I will probably make a longer video about this later on, but right now I am disgusted with Barack Obama for not doing a damn thing about, about the uh, uh, way that the protesters at Standing Rock are being treated. I'm disgusted with mainstream media for not giving this proper coverage, and instead most of it is focused on Trump, and I seem to have sort of fallen for that and fallen into that same thing. It's almost like media is being paid to put a bunch of other stuff in front of our face so we don't have to look at real issues like what's going on at Standing Rock. Did you know that uh, the FAA just recently made it so you can't fly drones over that area anymore? Some bullshit reasoning about the propellers so they could get caught in something. It's like, uh, no, no. This is because the drones have been catching what's really going on. And the government doesn't seem to want that. This is a collusion between business and government. I mean, the army has been sent out. You know, this, this is, this is a, a, a military zone now. Over people protesting over this. Over people protesting over their, their land being violated. The, the water being violated, mostly. I mean, we keep repeating the history of treating Native Americans like shit. But, you know, the only people that are supposed to have drones there are uh, people that are helping the uh, police or official uh, uh, approved media. Well, you know, out the window goes the First Amendment, you know, freedom of speech, freedom of the press. And nothing is being done about it. If on, on October, if on December 5th, uh, the army goes through with what they said they were going to do, although I've heard some other stories saying that they've retracted or backtracked a little bit on their, their position, but... On December 5th, uh, the protesters are basically going to be kicked out. So, a collusion between the government and, and business. Violating people's rights and not giving a flying fuck about the uh, the water supplies. Originally, there, there was, a, you know, a way that things were routed could have went uh, around some non-Native uh, American land. And, uh, you know, the people didn't like that, and they immediately were, oh, well, uh, okay, we'll put it somewhere else. Let's shit all over the Natives, the Native Americans, and... Uh, and that'll be okay, right? Well, apparently Barack Obama thinks it's okay, or he would have, you know, at least held some sort of press conference saying, hey, th this needs to stop. No, not a word about that. It's like he's in support of it. This is disgusting. You know, to me, it should go through the non-native lands. You know, let your water supply get polluted. If it's so safe, you know, if this shit gets much worse, and then we, we may not even know if it gets much worse, because it looks like they're cracking down on media, they're cracking down on, on drones, they're cracking down on any way that this stuff can really get out as to how terrible the situation actually is. But if things seem to get worse, they continue to carry out. I'm, I'm hoping there are going to be some major demonstrations and protests in major cities across the United States, because I will gladly get involved in that. Um, these, this is going to be a blight on our government. And I think the rest of the world knows this too. The rest of the world is watching. Is our government going to do the right thing or not? Looks like it's not. 